This video shows how to provision the Agoric Smart Wallet and how to use Inner Protocol PSM to swap stable tokens for IST. In preparation for this, I've transferred over 10 build to Agoric under the Kepler Wallet. And this enables us to use that 10 build to provision the Agoric Smart Wallet, as well as some USDC and USDT on the Axelar and Gravity networks. So the first step that we want to do is to launch the app. When we launch psm.inner.trade, it's first going to ask us to connect to Kepler. When we press the button, we'll get a disclaimer button. And after we proceed there, we will get an indication that the smart wallet has not been created yet. So go ahead and click on that link to come up with the wallet.agoric.app slash wallet site. Accept the disclaimer there after reading the terms of use. And then we will get the pop-up to create the smart wallet. This is where we need the 10 build. So I already have the 10 build transferred over into Kepler. So we're good to go there. And I can hit create. Approve the transaction with the fee of zero. And then it'll take a minute to go out to the blockchain and create the smart wallet. Awaiting smart wallet creation. And we should be good to go in just a minute. Now you can see the Agoric Wallet dashboard that we have zero build because we spent the 10 build on creating the smart wallet. We do have 0.25 IST, that's a little reward to use as gas fees, as well as some stable tokens that we can use for swapping with IST. However, we don't have the DAP connected yet. So switch the tabs back to the PSM and we can close out of that now. Click connect to Kepler again. Now the message is that it's trying to connect, but we need to approve it on the wallet page. So if we go there and approve the pop-up, then we will be connected. You can verify that by looking at the dApps tab and see that Inner Protocol PSM is listed as one of the dApps. Switching the tabs back to the PSM page, you can see that we've successfully connected the wallet. Now is the time where we can start switching some assets around. If we select here, the USDC Axelar, see as we have a balance of 100, click max there. Exchange rate is one to one, fee is zero. Create a swap offer. It says the swap offer has to be approved on the smart wallet. So we click there and we get an offer. Approve that proposed offer and approve the Kepler signing and we'll wait for it to go from pending to accepted. The box will turn gray once it's accepted and you can either leave this here or write it down and then close off these offers. Let's try one more. Let's go back to the PSM and instead of doing USDC Axelar here, let's do USDT Gravity. Again, it's 100 to 100, one to one and zero. The IST available is just the mint limits that are currently available for that swap pair. Create a swap offer, asks again to approve it on the wallet site. So approve the proposed connection and the Kepler entry. And when it approves, we will see that our dashboard will update. We still have zero build. We have 200 IST now and we've reduced our stable tokens by that. So we have successfully swapped stable tokens for 200 IST.